guys, so I'm here. I did a bunch of videos today. This is going to be the last one I'm doing of the day. Um, uh, it's just a haul video. So I did a few things. I went online and I checked out the 21 Days of Beauty at Ulta, so I got a couple things from there. So what I got from Ulta, let's see, they sent a bunch of little samples. The samples are just like some whatever, Vitabath, some retinol cream, Smashbox primer. Um, this is the black opium from YSL. Smells nice. Um, a couple little samples, more samples of little perfumes. And what I got, um, let me see how much this one was. I got the Anastasia Brow Gel. Uh, this was on, that was on the 7th. So this is the clear brow gel from Anastasia. So it just looks like, you know, like any regular mascara wand. Um, the wand itself is like a kind of short, um, very separated, kind of, it'll be good for combing out the brows. So that's good. And these three, I'm super excited. These deals, I believe that these were $11 a piece. These are from Too Faced. These are the La Creme Color Drench Lip Creams. Um, and I got three shades. I got Juicy Melon, Razzle Dazzle Rose, and Nude Beach. Um, so the packaging is just so, so pretty, really, really beautiful. So I'm going to go ahead and show you swatches of these really quickly and um, kind of tell you my thoughts of what they are. So let me just show you the swatches real quick. All these lip creams feel amazing on the lips just to let you guys know lip swatches when you're doing a lip swatch anything it's painful especially if you do it multiple times three is not so bad the last lip swatch video that I did oh my lips were on fire but anyway so these lip creams are amazing they <laughs> they feel so creamy they feel so good considering I was rubbing my lips they like make my lips feel so much better so I really like these the packaging is pretty amazing. They're these brushed kind of gold, almost rose, rose gold kind of um, uh, packaging. Super, super pretty. I am in love with what the packaging looks like. Um, each container is pretty heavy, has a nice weight to them. They feel very sturdy. Um, I like how the bottom not only has the names, but it also has like the shades and the colors on the bottom of the label. So uh, let me just tell you the shades that I have here swatched. I only got three shades and I think I might want to actually get more. So this one here is Nude Beach. The one in the center is Razzle Dazzle Rose. And, and this one here is called Juicy Melons. So I did have a hard time choosing which shades that I wanted to get. I blame this on Jen Loves Reviews because she talks so highly about this and she had pumped it up so much on Periscope and wherever and I was like okay I really want to try them and they're only $11 a piece man I wish I would have gotten more I really wish I would have gotten more I feel so like bummed that I didn't but um, I really like them I see why she was hyping them up so much they're really great the lasting power I couldn't say because I'm just using them for the first time right now but I can tell you they feel amazing on the lips 
and I wouldn't mind reapplying and reapplying because they feel so good when you're putting them on. They're so, so creamy and so, so smooth. Um, really awesome. So glad that I jumped on the bandwagon on these lip creams. So actually for now, that's all that I got on the 21 Days of Beauty. All right, next thing that I got, I actually got in from Starlux. I had a gift card that came in one of the Starlux subscriptions boxes and I got a lipstick from one of the collections. This one is from, uh, what is her name? I can't remember her name and I can't read it on the lipstick itself. Uh, Marcella, Marcella or something like that. Anyway, this is a neutral kind of color here. This one is, oh, it's called um, Screen Ready is the name of the, the lipstick. And it just looks like this. I'm not gonna do a lip swatch because my lips are in pain right now. But I can tell you these are not as creamy, but the color is pretty, pretty, pretty. Look at that, real pretty. Oh my gosh, I could see myself wearing this one all the time. So that is pretty. So those people that were saying that Starlux was not good, whatever, the lipstick is $15. I had a gift card for $20 off, so I did get the lipstick for free. So that is another thing, you know, going into the Starlux Starbucks. Um, so super excited about this lipstick. Okay, the next couple of things, um, I don't have the one of the polishes here because I used it to paint my nails, but these are um, the ones that are in clearance right now. These are from Orally, and these are three shades from, I think it's Beauty and the Beast. Crazy Old Maurice is this green color. This peachy color with um, glitter in it is called Positively Prime, oh, no. Oh, yeah, Positively Prime, I don't know how to say the word. I feel stupid because I think I know this word. Primeval, primeval, <laughs> Gaston, whatever. It's this beautiful peachy color with glitter in it. I think I want to do my nails that color. And then um, this one here is the other mini collection. And in here is Enchanted Rose, which is the bright magenta color over here. Then it has Lumiere's Light, which is a golden glitter. Um, Magic Mirror, which is a lavender cream. That's pretty. This is like my shade that I always like to go. And this is the same color, pa Positively Primeval Gaston. It's a peach shimmer. I don't know how to say that. I feel so dumb. Whatever. And then the last thing that I had picked up, and these were all on clearance. I think um, these big polishes were like a dollar seventy nine. I want to say, and then this might have been between one and three dollars, somewhere around there. I can't recall. Um, and then I got this lip gloss from the Mulan line, and this one is Rare Beauty. It's just a pink color. Um, and. I haven't used it yet, but I'm going to right now. Oh, it's so pretty. It's just like really, really pretty. Oh, and it's got Mulan right there. Okay, so it's just a clear, like a, just barely any color. I could probably give this to my daughter to actually use since it doesn't really show up this color. You know, she likes to have like lipstick and stuff like that but I'll give her stuff that doesn't really have any color. So that is really nice, and this is just so pretty. Really, really pretty. I kind of wish I had the entire collection, but I know the Evil Queens is out now. I put a picture on my Instagram and Facebook um, with the things that I have found. I don't really see anything that's calling to my name right now regarding the nail polishes that I saw. Um, it was nail polishes, some hair stuff, makeup bags, and was that it? I, I don't remember, but it's on my Instagram. Um, but I saw a picture, Michelle has sent me a picture of the makeup collection that is out. And if I find it, I definitely wanna to try to get the Evil Queen if I see it. All right, you guys, that's it. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you again in another video. Bye. Lip swatches hurt. A lot.